Good morning! It is now Saturday morning and we're just getting ready to check out of this hotel. It's been a really nice stay and I've really enjoyed it and I would definitely consider staying here again. We stayed at the Waldorf Hilton, Waldorf London, and it was, you know, relatively affordable compared to the other hotels and this was the hotel that we felt like had more space. So yeah, we enjoyed it and we're gonna see if we can leave our luggage downstairs. I actually need to call downstairs and just make sure that that's okay. And then we're gonna check out and Jasmine's on her way. We're so excited to see her. And I've got a little bit of a risky OOTD today because essentially it's cold and I, I don't know what I was doing when I was packing. I felt like I brought so many layering options and I kind of didn't. And I wore tights yesterday, so I kind of like don't want to wear tights again today. So I don't know, we'll see about that. But here is my OOTD. I am wearing this cute dress from Thread Up. Is this a bad angle? Yes. Okay, this dress is from Thread Up. It's seriously so cute. And I want to keep my arms accessible because we're getting tattoos today, we're pretty sure. Maybe, if they can take us. And then this denim jacket is from like the Rose Bowl Flea Market or the Melrose Trading Post. I thrifted it. Got my necklace on from Drew. This is my favorite necklace and I like wearing it when I'm traveling because like I don't know if that's corny but it kind of feels like he's with me and stuff. Um, and it's a locket. I think I've shown it before in vlogs but he got this for me for Christmas either last year or the year before and it's a picture of us from a date night that we had when we went to Tokyo in like 2018. And then I'm wearing my thrifted cowboy boots and yes I do have bare legs however I do have a pair of tights in my purse in case I get really cold and need to put them on like in a bathroom somewhere. And then Alexa here is looking so cute. Look at her. Look at her little thrifted fit. She looks so cute and she's gonna have her arms accessible as well. Yes. Because, and you I'm know. so excited to be able to wear a sweater vest again. Oh yeah, I bought one yesterday and I kind of thought about wearing it, but I was like, no, I need to like wash it and stuff first. So anyways, that's our plan. We're gonna head downstairs. Oh, for those that are so concerned about my sleep schedule, um, because when I don't sleep, I make it everyone's problem. I slept from 2 a.m. is when I fell asleep. I don't know what's going on, or like 2.30. And I slept until nine, and I had my earplugs in, and Alexa was outside, like she had been up and at him since like 6 a.m. And I thought she was sleeping next to me in the bed because I saw this. And I was like, Alexa, <laughs> and she wasn't replying. And then I texted her. Um, so she's been up since six. She's been out and about, popping around town, going to Pret, and I was asleep. So anyways, okay, that's our plan. We're gonna go head out and enjoy our last full day in London. There's possibility we might come back here like later on and maybe we'll go try to head towards like the palace and see the queen or something. Not like see the queen because that line is like 17 hours long, but like just go in the area. We'll see. Goodbye, big beautiful room with the beds pushed together that we think is kind of weird, but honestly was fine. <laughs> We will see you next time. You in the backyard of your old farm in the summer. So we're going to brunch at this place called Mildred's. It's a plant-based place and it looks really tasty. So let's check it out. Look who has arrived. She got on the wrong train, but she made it. <laughs> Just in time. We're at brunch, and we have a nice little avocado toast and Harissa home fries wow. situation. Okay. Alexa got a tofu scramble that looks very delicious. And then these? <laughs> Are you joking? These like maple banana pancake oh, situation with some kind of cream. Delicious. Wait, wait, wait. All right. Next stop. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Next stop is um, a bit of a brave one because we actually have a little bit of time before we get our tattoos done, which we did make an appointment for 3.30. Um, we are going to attempt to head near the palace, Buckingham Palace, just to sort of see the environment, like see the area, because we're obviously not gonna be able to get anywhere near the queen. Um, but we might just see like how far we can get and what we can see and maybe, I don't know, it's like an interesting time in history. Obviously as Americans, we don't understand it, but it might be a cool thing to like, you know, see and experience. So that's where we're headed.
All right, so we came and went. The situation was um, very crowded, which we should have known. And we did kind of know, but we did see like a couple of the areas um, that people were leaving flowers, but essentially like the main park was closed. And then it just became like really, really crowded. So we dipped, but now we're heading to Camden and we're gonna get our tattoos. And Jasmine's getting her ears pierced and we're very excited. Okay, we made it into Camden. That's Rocket Vintage, where we filmed a YouTube video a couple years ago. There's the Pret we went to. We're gonna stop at this food stall inside of Camden Market where Jasmine is gonna try something she saw on TikTok, which is essentially like a Yorkshire pudding wrapped roast burrito thingy, which sounds amazing. She's gonna let me have a bite. And then we're heading to our tattoos, which we already located the place. It looks really, really cool. I hope they'll let us like sneak some footage in there. It's actually kind of warm outside. It feels amazing. It feels like a spring day. I love it. All right, she found the place. It's called Yorkshire Burrito. I am very curious to see how this turns out. So Alexa and I are just gonna walk around. This is tasty. You like it? Mmm. What's in it? Better than I thought. It's chicken, potatoes, spinach, Yorkshire pudding, gravy. It's just delicious. Circle so perfect. Are you kidding? <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute. Oh love my it. gosh. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. Yeah. yeah. Love it. Yeah. <laughs> it looks so cute and it's it so perfect. Literally, I decided like four minutes ago. Yeah, I know. That's so mad. Just finished with my tattoo. So cute. Alexa, like, you want to show yours? Oh, your dress. Yeah. She got a heart. Yeah. You'll see. You'll see on like her Instagram and stuff. But we just made a quick stop to get some pizza. We're at Camden Pizza Co. I think I just accidentally ordered an entire pizza. But that's gonna be like our plan. Just like eat something really quick and then head back to the hotel, pick up our bags, and then make the train journey over to like Jasmine's neck of the woods. And we're very, very excited. <laughs> Okay, so I just got back to Jasmine's and she left a little care package on the bed. So she got me some Yorkshire tea, obviously. And this is biscuit flavor, which looks delicious. Some Maltesers, one of my faves. A cute little pumpkin candle, a little towel and washcloth. Got a little sheet mask, I will definitely be using that. A candle, noir, myrrh, and vanilla bean. Amazing, a cute little succulent. A happy, wait, what is this? Happy Hippo Biscuit by Kinder. Like how precious is that? Adorable. We have some nice fuzzy socks. We have, I think this is like hand sanitizer. I'm pretty sure. Cute. And then some hand cream. How cute is that? I've already started, you know, putting my stuff in. So I've already made myself at home. Now I think we're going to head to Tesco and get some food because we can't go shopping for food on Monday because the yeah. queen passed away. And so they're closing the grocery store. <laughs> Everything. On Monday. Everything. So Everything. we're gonna make sure that we have food to make for that day. So that's where we're going now. But my cute little room is all set up. I'm so happy. 
Okay, it is the end of day two. I am currently in the guest room at Jasmine's. It is 1.25 in the morning. The last couple of nights I've stayed up really, really late, but like it's felt normal to me. I don't know, jet lag is very weird. But I just took my CBD slash melatonin gummy, so hopefully that will kick in soon. I will be able to fall asleep and have some decent sleep and we have a really fun exciting day planned for tomorrow and it's been a really great day today too got my new tattoo that was very exciting i can't even remember if i vlogged it but i left my camera at the tattoo studio and then we walked all the way back to the train station which was only like a block away but had to walk back because i was like gotta go back and get that and thank god it was still there and we ordered some indian food for dinner we went to tesco's got some food some snacks some other exciting things for a future main channel video that'll be really fun and yeah we're gonna have a great day tomorrow so thank you so much for watching and for hanging out and i will see you tomorrow good night